Hey everyone, welcome back to another Plan With Me video. My name's Alyssa and this is my channel, She Reads, She Reads Books. I have this crystal here. I think it's the Fool's Gold crystal. Um, just as a reminder to stay in my view. And I have the calendar. I think this is the Google calendar on my phone up right now. Um, or not the Google calendar, but just the one that I have on my phone and I figured I would try going from paper planning to digital planning um, for the week so I'm just doing tomorrow for right now and it's currently Monday uh, the 27th and it's around it's 7 19 so almost 7 20 but if you can see, this is the days, so the individual days section. I'm just going to tilt that down just a little bit more. This is the individual days section, and it actually, what, oh, whoops. Nope. So, what's cool is it actually has the hours of the day on the side. So those little numbers, which I don't even think you can see. Are the days so they're time blocks so between 7 and 8 I have wake up because that's the easiest time that I can wake up early and okay and I have like read scriptures and then chores after um, waking up between 7 and 8 and I feel like this might be a good way, like, even if I wrote this out in my Hominichi, um, it might help me to stick to more of a schedule, because that's what I've been trying to do for the past few weeks, and just trying to figure out my schedule. So, I have, after chores, I have write the rest of chapters, chapter one and book two of my change freedom book so I'm working on book two right now and I know that I have to go back just looking through I have to go back and edit some stuff but this is just kind of version one of the story um so all I have so far are the time blocks between 7 and 1 p.m. in the afternoon. And after writing chapter 1 between 10 and 11, I have reading, and that's kind of reading whatever um, I want to read between 11 and 12. And then I have workout, which I just want to work on doing just sit-ups. So just kind of going to plan the rest of my day. I know I've already started it, but that's because I was just figuring out how to work it and I'm wondering if it will give me a notification somehow, like a ding for or vibrate whenever I need to do something. And it will kind of help keep me motivated to do a certain set of things throughout the day. I think between one and two I'm gonna try and do some yoga with Adrian video workouts. Well, it's yoga, but it's still kind of a workout. Between one and two, between two and three, I'm going to try and put uh, some more reading in. Read more. Between three and four, write the rest of chapter one in new book, which is my sci-fi sci-fi book. In my sci-fi book, that will be between three and four tomorrow. And this is just a tester, even if it. Um, because I know my boyfriend's going to drop off my blanket that I left over at his house. Which I'm sad because it's my favorite blanket. <laughs> but. What was that noise? Probably came from downstairs. 
What sucks is if the lighting seems a bit lower, that's because all of my lights now on my fan have been burnt out today. I met my fiance went to go turn on the light and he's like, oh, that sucks. The light flew out. I'm like, great. And I'm just going to make it like a day of raining tomorrow because I've been wanting to do that. So I have like rain scriptures and then I'll have rain whatever book I want to. Um, and this is just kind of an extra video for today just because I feel like filming and keeping myself awake so I can FaceTime. I meant, um, because he's going to help me with something on my laptop. <sighs> Between five and six, I'm assuming would be about dinner. Or even, actually, hang on. Sometimes we have dinner, um, between five, six, like, last night we had dinner around eight, so sometimes we have dinner around, like, between seven and eight, or seven to nine is about the time frame that we cook dinner as a family and have dinner. And actually, I like the way that this is looking. <laughs> and I think I may write it in here. And I know that not every day is going to look like this. Like tomorrow I'm putting more raining than I am writing. And I think for 7 and 8 I will do write chapter 2 of book 2. CF for change freedom. Just cause I can. Um, actually, I'm going to put that between 8 and 9, because maybe I can write chapter 3 as well. It just kind of depends on the speed that I'm writing the chapter and how it's going, and I really like how it's a whole block, if you can see that. It's just kind of, um, do... 20 more sit-ups before bed. And then be in bed by 10, 10, 30 p.m. So changing the time. I think I've tried this once before, but it's hard for me to stick to schedules, and I'm trying to fix that. So, we have been by 10.30, and it's a little tiny notch. So, that's kind of an overview of tomorrow, even though it, you can't see it clearly. I'm so sorry. <sighs> I don't even know how to fix that with this camera, so we just stick with it. Anyways, tomorrow we'll be working on book two of this, and also my sci-fi story, and a bunch of reading hopefully I can get done between that time, and at some point my fiancé will come by and drop the blanket off, but I'm not going to really let that throw off my schedule. Um, even if it does and we end up hanging out or something or talking for a little bit and it kind of throws off the timing of the schedule, like my time blocks, um, I'm going to just work around that and still do what I need to do. Like, it's kind of a regular day. Or like a not 
I'm not making it busy, but I'm making it relaxed and more focused on writing, and this is for the 28th. So, that is for the 28th. In my planner, though, I do want to put that I'm going over to my grandmother's. It's the 28th, so 29th. Alright, so I am going to be, um, doing some house cleaning to earn some money at my grandparents and swim, um, but yeah, that's just something that I wanted to try, and I will let you know on Wednesday, even though I already have a video going up on Wednesday, I think, as well. Um, I will let you know how this whole day went, and we'll see. I think I'm, with the calendar, like the actual calendar, it will make a notification. What does the week look like? Oh, so the week looks like this. It changed it up a little bit, but... I can't really see. I can tell you what I'm doing. Um, so, I will put for Wednesday, like after lunch, which is usually around 2, um, going to Mama's house. Um, it won't be, it will maybe be two to three, depending on how long the chores take. I should probably do two to four, actually, because sometimes I swim a little longer, so I have that. So let's switch it back to the day so we have the day for Tuesday and then from 2 to 4 is my grandmother's house and I have been staying inside um, I haven't really gone out anywhere so, actually, I'm going to even try waking up tomorrow earlier between, okay, hang on, I think I need to make it eight, okay, so I had to make this eight, or between six and eight, just because I wanted to try and wake up a bit earlier. So I wrote going to Mama's in here as well as in here because sometimes I do look in here more often than I do on this. But that is going to be it for today's video. Let me know if you guys use your phone planners or do you use your home and HEs. Um, I'm still kind of new-ish to the planning, but as you can see, I've been using my planner. That week I didn't really write much. I think last week I hardly wrote in here, or in this. It's stuck, there we go. And I like that it's a bluish purple color, and let me turn up the brightness. So, that is it for my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think, and 
I will see you in the next video. I hope you guys are all doing well and you're, that you're all safe and staying inside. And if you go out, I hope you wear a mask. Um, I haven't really had to go out into stores, so I haven't worn masks because I go between my house and my fiance's house, and that's about it. And they haven't really gone anywhere um, besides work and home, and that's about it. So, yeah, I hope you're all doing well, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and check out Chain Freedom. Um, at least version one of it. I do have it on ebook as 99 cents if you don't want the paperback, even though, like, I know it has that weird, um, spine lock in there, but we all did our best with getting this together, and I hope you guys enjoy the story anyways. I'm working on book two, like I said, and yeah. I will see you guys later. Bye.